Hi folks, this is all the fruit and the Riviera doesn't stop to amaze me. Here at the same geographical latitude as southern Canada, on the in the foothills of the Alps, the craziest subtropical stuff is growing. I knew that white sapote is growing here. I've seen one in Hanbury Gardens. And here I'm less than less than five or maybe five to ten kilometers away from Hanbury Gardens. And here I find the same thing growing in some abandoned agricultural terraces. Ain't that amazing? Apart from that, I saw a couple abandoned olives and carob trees and all the other stuff you can expect here. But two white sapote. <clears throat> and I don't know, down at this construction site, this tree with the big round crown. The leaves, they do look <coughs> a bit similar to white sapote. What do you think, folks? Or what do you know? Can somebody check for me? Is white sapote actually a normal fruit tree on the Riviera? Because here, in this abandoned garden, those are definitely two trees. And they must have been planted here many decades ago because this place was abandoned many decades ago. And so, a couple decades of abandonment, a couple decades for growth of those white sapote must be quite old. One tree, two trees, and I don't know down there if this is a third tree. What do you think, folks? Can somebody enlighten me if white sapote is actually grown commonly on the Italian Riviera? The Latin name is Casimiroa edulis, and it's a citrus relative of the family Rotaceae. So this was the white sapote, the most unexpected place in the world. Stay tuned for a lot more fruit videos from the beautiful Italian Riviera. And don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe.